this is how easily you put the wheel on. Literally, just slide it over the studs like, a, like on your normal car. Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. Very unplanned video. I want to crack on with my new uh, board, but I thought before I start putting parts together, uh, I want to just cover the 3D services new hub system dries very quickly. Okay, these here are the uh, Finality by 3D Services. These are custom color. Uh, they were made blue for me on the dice because I wanted to and also come as custom with the clear uh, barrels. This is what I wanted, okay? So what's so good about this? You guys keep on asking me that, oh, it's so expensive, whatever not. Okay, the way I see this is uh, for the money, you get the front trucks, you get the base plate, you get the hubs, you get the uh, uh, the actual wheel hubs as well. What I mean hubs is this new hub system I'll show you in a second. You do get the gear drives, you do get the uh, 3D printed uh, uh, bash guards, you get uh, base plates as I mentioned, you do get the barrels, everything comes assembled. The only thing you need to do is stick the motors in and you're good to go. So if you <laughs> calculate uh, between the quality uh, obviously, obviously, also uh, this being very innovative uh, uh, design. Uh, try calculating like uh, uh, belts, pulleys, uh, wheels themselves, bearings separately, hangers, base plates, barrels. So try doing that. Let's say using another company like a tramp or someone, and then look at the uh, price of these. But again, it's up to you. I'm not selling 3D services. Yes, I am his friend, like his skate friend. Uh, he's from. Yeah, far away country from UK, but he's my neighboring country in Baltic state. Uh, he's from Lithuania, I'm from Estonia, so we're pretty much neighbors. Um, so that's it really much. So this is here, is the rear. So obviously you got your gear drives on it. Very, very thin, very, very nice as uh, these are. These are the uh, uh, spur drives, the yeah. helical. I also have a uh, straight cut, the eco drives on my uh, tsunami board, and I absolutely love them. This should be quieter, but we'll test it very, very soon. Okay. So this here, by the way, this whole lot you see in my hands is three and a half kilo, so three thousand five hundred grams, three and a half kilo. This setup, everything but tires. So let's put this gently on the side, and uh, let's talk about actual hub system. Okay, so this here is the hub system. Okay, uh, the hub itself or the wheel hub is uh, fixed to the uh, hub. I'll explain to you with nuts. These are same kind of uh, type nuts like you would have in your car, uh, with nice little uh, cone shape. So they center themselves when you put them uh, onto the uh, uh, threaded uh, studs. So this is how the hub wheel hub comes off, just like this. Okay. And this is the wheel hub. It's made out of two parts, precision cut, absolutely gorgeous. Yeah. And this will be fitted with the nine inch uh, uh, tramper tires, the diamond cut. So here, what you have is the hub system. Okay. So everything is contained inside the part right here. You got two conical bearings. Everything is precision uh, cut. Everything is precisionly put together. It's full with grease. It got a seal all the way around here, so no water gets inside, and it's absolutely gorgeous. It's so well made, and this is the one of the benefits. So, guys, you was asking, what's the benefit? Okay, normally, on a normal wheel, you have your bearing, your spacer, your bearing, then you have your speed washer, speed washer, nut, everything goes on a single axle, and you over tighten, it gets tight, and it's just that hassle. Here, you don't have anything you got five studs okay so what you do you take the hub apart yeah like you normally would do you put your tire on it inflate it slide it over these studs just like that and using these uh, nuts you tighten that up done so in order to take this wheel off literally five nuts done no spaces no washers none of that inside the wheel hub okay so I'll show you the side that's already assembled. Okay, so this is now fully assembled aside, the tire is on, yeah? And you got the five nuts holding it in place. Simple as this. The operation is so smooth, is unbelievable. 
but one really, really positive part to benefit about all this, that even if you really try very, very hard, there is absolutely no movement, there's no wobble, there's no, there's nothing to play around, there's nothing to jump around on the axle. Everything is contained inside this new hub system. And because it's a large conical uh, bearings in here, it's like in a car hub. It all gets squished together and keeps itself together really, really well, okay? So in order to get inside, uh, it's this uh, screws right here, the cup comes off, and that's where the bearings are, and that's where the grease is. But the chances that you have to take this apart are almost zero, okay? So this is the quality up close. Very, very nice. These base plates are put by 3D services as well. These are the finalities. So it's like a trumpet truck, but redone, redesigned, shape changed, and uh, it is a pre precision cut. Okay? As I said, the color is custom for me, for my new build. Okay, beautiful. And uh, another good part, so if you have your, let's say, um, rear wheel blow out or your front wheel blow out, regardless front to back, four nuts, take it off, put a spare rim back on. So potentially, and this is what I'm going to do, is buy another uh, hub, so I can have fully assembled wheel with me with the same tire as the rest of the board. So if you're stuck somewhere with a puncture, four nuts off and the new wheel back on. Sorry, five nuts. <laughs> and what I th thought I'll mention as well, this is how much thought went into this uh, system. If you look carefully, you can see that the holes for where the nuts sit and where the studs come through, they're conical. Yeah, it's the same cone as is on the nut itself. So when you're catching it, yeah, it will center the hub nicely. So no wobbles, everything straight, nice and perfect. So that's it really. Ah, with the kit, uh, you get um, uh, some seals. That's for your that's for your gear drives because you need to take the gear drives front off in order to pull the motors on. But it's very simple. You also get grease, the special designs by 3 Services grease, and some uh, nuts as well. You get two for usage and two for spare, okay? So that's pretty much uh, what it is. So, so this is it, guys, uh, for this video. Just a quick over overview, more detail. I will have more videos, uh, uh, how to put motors on it and whatever not. So stay tuned. I also have some videos coming out. I'm building an absolutely awesome mountain electrical skateboard. I have video coming out soon on the best recipe in my mind, best recipe for electrical skateboarding uh, build uh, DIY. That's it really. Uh, drive safely, ride safely, be safe, build safely. Well, you know. Anyway, get you soon. Bye.